Hello everyone. Welcome to MS Active webcast. In this video, we are going to see the steps on how to create and manage mail user in Exchange Online. In Exchange Online organizations, mail users are similar to mail contacts. Both have external email addresses and both contain information about people outside of your Exchange Online organization that can be displayed in the shared address book and other address list. However, unlike a mail contact, a mail user has sign-in credentials in your Microsoft 365 organization and can access resources. We can create and manage mail users using Exchange Admin Center or Exchange Online PowerShell. To create new mail user, we need to access and log in to the Exchange Admin Center. For that, open your favorite web browser and type in the URL https colon double slash admin dot exchange dot microsoft dot com and press enter key. This is the email address of my administrator. Let's enter the password and click on sign in. In the Exchange Admin Center, we need to go to the Recipient section and then we need to click on Contacts. In the last video, we have created one contact named Grunal Rajput and that we can see in Exchange Admin Center. To create a new mail user, we need to click on Add a Contact. Select Mail User from the drop-down list and which is selected by default. And the first name and last name for the contact. By default, display name box shows the values from the first name and the last name boxes. We can accept this default value or based on requirement, we can change it. Now, enter the user's email address, which is going to be david.warner at gmail.com. Then next, we need to enter a unique alias name for this user. And here, I'm going to add a David W. Okay, this is going to be the alias address for this mail user. And then we need to enter the user ID that this person will use to sign in to this service. And I'm going to specify the same. So our user ID is also going to be David W. And then we need to select the domain by clicking on this drop down button. And here we have our domain name clarex.onmicrosoft.com. If you have added multiple domains to your organization, that time you can select the domain which you want to use as a user ID. So the user's ID in our case is going to be David W at clarex.onmicrosoft.com. Then we need to set up account password for this mail user. Okay, and then we simply need to click on add to create new mail user. We can see the message contact created successfully. Click on close. If you don't see the newly created mail user in admin center, click on refresh to update the list. So I'm going to click on refresh. And here we go. Here we have our mail user named David Warner. And this is the, his uh, email address, david.warner at gmail.com. Under contact type, we can confirm that this is mail user. Now, I also want to access Microsoft 365 Admin Center. So let's click on App Launcher. And here we have our admin. Uh, I'm going to open in a new tab. So let's open Microsoft 365 Admin Center. In Microsoft 365 Admin Center, I'm going to click on Users and then click on Active Users. Here we can see the information about our mail user David Warner. Now, this is the user which we have created. Let me show you that again. Okay, this is the user. Let's try to find the user Krunal Rajput in Microsoft 365 Admin Center as well. If you see the list of active users in 365 Admin Center, we are not able to see the user account of our mail contact Krunal Rajput. Why? Because mail contact doesn't have a user account in our organization 
Uh, on other hand, mail user has an account in Office 365 Admin Center. Okay. Let's click on our user, David Warner. And on account app, we can see user's login name, which is uh, dvw at larex.onmicrosoft.com. Uh, let's click on mail tab. We can see the message that this user doesn't have an Exchange Online license assigned to him. That means a user David Warner doesn't have Exchange Mailbox in our Exchange Online organization. So mail user has an user account in our organization with external mailbox. That concludes the video on how to create mail user in Exchange Online using Exchange Admin Center. Thank you for watching this video. Have a nice day.